Oi, oi, lads. Anybody down for some uh, 100 card Yogmoth? I didn't even think of the possibilities of a Yogmoth Prawl deck, but I saw CGB do a video on it. I was like, you know what, CGB? You got me. That's a good idea. I've made my own version. I mean, it's pretty much the same, though, but... Or it's the same idea. I don't really know. It's, it's too hard. <laughs> I watched the start of his video on in one game on my phone, but the screen is too small to actually see any cards in his deck, but I imagine it's similar. So this is uh, Yoggers. 100 card Yoggers. Let's go. What format is this? It's just historic brawl, man. Just trying out Yogg Moth. <laughs> Turn one Wastrider. Is that good? I don't even know if it is even that good. But it, it doesn't sound terrible, that's true. Alright, turn one, War Strider go. I mean, it, it lets us get in for a bit of pressure, and every bit, against these Asika piles, every bit of damage that we can get through is going to be <clears throat> quite important, right? <clears throat> we need to do some scrying, though. If they just go for the bridge... <clears throat> Hopefully we can find a removal for it. The problem is, uh, scrying, it gives up a draw. Fuck that. Let's just, let's just play Yoggers. <clears throat> Although, playing Connoisseur is also tempting, though. Have, in case they get a creature off of the bridge, having the Death Touch could be good. Shrines! What the? <clears throat> Kusima! <clears throat> Alright, Shrine Pile should be a little easier to beat than, than Planeswalker Pile. <clears throat> I mean, I say that now, but I, st I still believe it. Okay, Big, big Daddy Bond too. Top decked, by the way, because it didn't. We didn't get it with the connoisseur. <clears throat> Go yogurts. Surely Kozilek will do something against the Sika Pile this time. <clears throat> okay, GG. GG Cleansing Nova. 
Hey, at least they have to kill two of their own creatures. Opponents just playing only gods. Shrines and gods. Oh, this is sick. Whenever you pay life, put that many counters on Font of Agony. Every time we kill a creature with Yogurs, we pay life. So every time we draw four cards, we get to kill a creature. Kinda gas. Four mana flying blood artist coming through. Okay, we're doing it chat. <clears throat> I think we're doing it. Decimating the god pile. So the, the thing is, because you've got this sack outlet just available, you don't really need a ton of sack outlets, so you just you just play a bunch of stuff that benefit from dying. And that's that's basically the deck. With a few a few little combos mixed in. To to be able to win out of nowhere. <clears throat> This guy is just like a like a bad wash rider, really. But I think it's fine because we've got the normal good wash rider too. It's like a, it's basically a second wash rider to help you if you've got the citadel out. This this guy is just <clears throat> lethal if you've got it on board, right? What do we want? Do we want the scry or do we want to try and get the blood artist done? Sure. Alright, we made a we made the correct choice. Cat. Witch's cottage, huh? Ooh. <clears throat> I'll take Witch's Cottage. We can put Blood Artist on the top of the deck.
That's pretty gas. <clears throat> Alright, their Bolas is coming down and I need to be able to attack it. But I can't really. Bit of an issue. I guess this is the best way to threaten an attack. <coughs> In fact, this thing is fucking sick. They can't even play their ball ass now. <clears throat> I'm sitting here saying I can't threaten to attack ball ass, and I've probably got the best card in my deck for doing so. What a fool. I'm the best fire starter there is. Five devotion, right? Okay. <clears throat> Alright. One, one more chat. That, that wasn't a game. That doesn't count. Jet Mirror. Okay. Okay, Jet Mir. <clears throat> yeah, I think this deck just wants sack synergy rather than sack outlets. Obviously, you want more strider though, just because it's broken as hell, but. Two mana, two, two. When it dies, get another two, two. What a card. Alright, Jetmere is officially popping. We go Wostrider first or just go straight into the Yoggers? <clears throat> straight into the Yoggers, right? Start uh, eating these tokens up. Swords to plowshares. Sack Reaper draw two. <clears throat> Sack Reaper draw two and kill a creature. The answer is yes. Dude, this cottage is fucking insane. We can put the the Reaper back on top again. <clears throat> I don't don't think we need the bog. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, what the hell is that thing? I can't beat that card. Huh? <clears throat> Oh my god, what a scam. <clears throat> Bestial Menace. 
create a 1-1-2-2 one, one, two, two and a 3-3. Three, three. Alright, give me my Reapy boy back. Pass. Okay, we've got a real game going on, chat. We're playing, we're playing some games. They just don't even use their jet mirror. What does this do? Whenever a non-token creature dies, you gain one life, then you may draw a card, discard a card. <clears throat> okay, seems... Seems absolutely gas. <clears throat> I will attack for one. Could you, could you stop, maybe? Draw a card, yep. Discard a card. Yep. <clears throat> and when we have six... Six creatures in the graveyard, we can pay two to get GPG back. Okay. Dude, opponent's going to be dead in no time, man. They're already down to 24. Okay, that's a Monkaius. That is... That's a good card. This is a 4-mana Flying Blood Artist, if you've never seen it before. The Falcon Wrath Noble. Leyline? Sure. Feed the swarm. Creature or enchantment? Bro. Not like this. <clears throat> okay. That's going to be a minus seven life from us here. But this is why we play the blood artist, baby. Land on top that we can't play. Easy cycle. Two mana... Wait, this costs three life. <clears throat> okay, does... Bolas' Citadel... Does not target. <laughs> does this thing target? It does. Whoops. I should have left some mana open. <clears throat> I should have left some mana open. They need to attack attack while I've got no mana. You fool! <clears throat> okay, let's let's try and gain some life, chat. Let's try and gain some life. <laughs> Give me a yog moth. It really is. Ping. Dude, it costs me... It's two mana to fucking do anything. Oh my god. I need to pay one to target their creature and one to get my blood artist trigger. What the hell is this shit? <laughs> I'm stuck. <clears throat> okay, kill... Kill one creature. 
sack your guy. Pay the trigger. Pay both. Draw, yep. Discard, yep. Bastion is gas. Pay again. <clears throat> I feel like going to three here, to be honest. <clears throat> I don't think there is a card in my deck that removes this Valkmira, so this game is going to take forever. Imagine trying to remove an artifact with mono black. <clears throat> Alright, destroyed. Decimated the opponent with our late game value. Ah, let's do one more, man. One more, last one. Definitely last one. Then we'll do a card review. What is that? Is that Coma? Coma? Okay, discard seems good against Coma. Nest this plus this, by the way. Whenever you put one or more minus one minus one counters on a creature, create that many black insect creature tokens. Just casual infinite loop. <coughs> no big deal. <laughs> they discarded their crows and grit. Oh, you're a fool opponent. A goddamn fool. Mm -mm. Brainstorm. Decent card. Locked. Opponent is definitely locked. All of their enchantments cost one less mana. If there's any in hand. <clears throat> Alright chat, so... Question. How do we beat a coma? Search your library for a black card with mana value less than or equal to the number of creature cards in your graveyard. Okay, I can search my... Library for a card that costs zero, and there is none. I have none. So that's that's pretty that's pretty cool. We definitely go yogers and kill this pixie, right? <clears throat> Sack your auger. Make a pleb. Sack your pleb. Make a pleb. Oh wait, we just insta-kill the coma as soon as it comes into play. <laughs> While drawing our whole deck. Okay. That's pretty good. <clears throat> that is a fair combo. Ah! No! Can I, can I get that back? I need that back, man. A black card that costs one can be tutored for. <clears throat> Seems dumb. Alright, 
Alright, give me a draw to trigger the weak. Acquisitions expert. Pretty nice. This is a wizard, we get to see both cards. <clears throat> Daddy Gargaroth, huh? You're not drawing three cards, so... <clears throat> I'll take on Daddy Gargaroth. <clears throat> I'll freaking take him on. Give me a sack. Vex <laughs> actually kind of busted. Yogg is so cool. He's very broken, huh? One more for the road. Okay, la last one for sure. Bolas again. <clears throat> this card's fucking sick, man. Hunted Witness, the perfect card for her deck. It's just, there's two draws off of Yoggers. <clears throat> Siphon Insight. Best format cube has got. I don't. Is cube gone? I think it's still there, right? I was gonna do some cube later. Whenever one or more non-token creatures die, create a 2-2 two -two black zombie creature token with Decayed. Seems good. Dark Ritual. Well, Scholar of Frost. <clears throat> I've never seen Dark Ritual into Will Scholar of Frost before. You need to slow down. Let's talk. Create X tapped tokens where X is my power? Huh? I can't even, I can't sack it until next turn, right? <clears throat> so we, we sack this, we draw a card, we make a 1-1 one, one and a 2-2. Two, two. Pretty damn good. The Harvester of Souls. Six mana, five, five, death touch. Whenever another non-token creature you dies, on either side, you may draw a card. Very cool.
mean, to be honest, we just need lands. What's our plays, chat? What is the play? Bolas is coming down and would quite like to kill the Bolas. This kills the bolas. <laughs> Thanks for the zombie fool. They can't even play their commander, man. <clears throat> Our board is simply too threatening. Okay, they played their commander. Your is Grim Tutor. That seems like it should be good. Get the damage, sack them up. <clears throat> come on, come back, man. <clears throat> Did that 1-1 one, one squirrel is so gas because they can't... They have to keep losing their bolas to the stupid squirrel every time they demine it. People keep conceding, man. Ecuador! Ecuador! <laughs> <laughs> 